Uh, clearly today, we, we still have individuals on our streets that's walking around with guns. And as I stated yesterday, the community needs to come together and make sure that they're support, supplying the support to the police to ensure that these individuals are taken off our streets. Our government has been very clear in that we want uh, the, the minimum uh, mandatory sentences for these individuals that are caught with a weapon. Clearly, they cannot just go in and out of our court system. We've been tough on crime and we want to ensure that Canadians are safe right across this country. This is not just endemic to Toronto. We have this issue in Edmonton, we have it in BC, we have it in Nova Scotia. And we clearly want to ensure that Canadians feel safe within their communities. And the only way that we can do that is to ensure that we have tough laws on our books, to ensure that hardened criminals are removed off our streets. And so we will continue to put forth uh, the tough legislation. But mixed with that is our anti-gang and anti-drug strategy has been brought down by our government. We want to ensure that we're investing back in communities, ensuring that young people have the opportunities that they need uh, once they've gone off the track, that they have those opportunities to come back and to ensure that they're re rehabilitated into society. So we're not all about just incarceration. We're about intervention and prevention.